Criminal cases in more than a dozen Wisconsin counties against Ford Atkinson contractors Tyler and Jennifer Hansen are likely to be dropped. But that's because the couple is prepared to plead guilty in federal court to mail fraud and money laundering. Tony Galley spoke with one of the many victims on the coming accountability for these contractors. I'm relieved. In a federal plea agreement for contractors Tyler and Jennifer Hansen, they admit cheating customers in more than a dozen Wisconsin counties under a host of different company names, including Beloit's Aaron Asher and his wife. The Ashers tell me Hansen dug these four foot holes in their backyard when he was working on their deck that he never finished. Add useless doors to what was left behind. So we have some pictures of holding up a tape measure where we're showing okay. that it's like too small or too short. Restitution, as assets allow, is part of this plea agreement. The federal court here will address what authorities say was fraud carried out by Tyler and Jennifer Hansen. Customer Aaron Asher hopes that more will be done to protect people from grifters in this industry. I just hope in the future that, you know, something can be done statewide where these, these, these companies can change their names at the drop of a hat. While sentences will be more lenient because the Hansons accepted responsibility, years of prison are still possible. Prison keeps them out of the public. Aaron Asher would prefer probation for the Hansons to allow them to work and pay back victims. Tony Galley, 27 News. Court schedules indicate many of the state cases against the Hansons will be dismissed on or before September 27th. That's the day the Hansons appear in federal court in Madison to be sentenced.